Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. Today we're going to start the bike code. I haven't started it in probably about a week. It's been raining a lot in California. So we're gonna do a cold start. I'm gonna do some revs so you guys can kind of see the exhaust. And I know a couple of you guys have some questions about it. So I figured it would be a lot easier for me to just show you instead of trying to explain it. So um, check it out. All right, peeps, I'm about to start the bike. It's gonna be loud. All right, guys, the reason it's keep doing that is because the, vo the vibration of the bike is vibrating it into like first gear or vibrating it to second gear. It's like kind of teeter tottering a little bit. We're gonna give it another go and I'm, and I'm hoping you can kind of see where the smoke is coming from. You can kind of see it coming out. Yeah, guys, like I said, um, some of it's condensation and um, some of it's probably a little oil burning off because the 2012 Ducatis do have are known for having different oil oil. The 2012 Ducatis are known for having different oil ring designs. In other words, the piston ring sets are different than um, on the earlier one. And I believe 2013, maybe late 2012, they changed it to where they changed it to help limit the smoke in that first startup. Another thing it could probably be is a little oil seepage from like when a bike sits and stuff correlates to the oil rings also but just remember uh, with this engine design some oil burning smoking during first warm-up doesn't really necessarily mean that it correlates to higher amounts of oil being used so if so if you do have at first start off have your bike smoking a little bit or it seems like it might be smoke just keep just keep an eye on the oil as long as it's not like burning oil excessively to where like you can tell dramatic changes in your oil level and then I think you'll be all right. You can see whenever I read the exhaust, it kind of, there's a little water that came out condensation because it is about 65 degrees outside. So for California, that's a little chilly. That's why I have a sweater and fleece on and stuff, but it's a little chilly. That does um, have something to do with the extra smoke looking stuff coming out. When our bike got to operating temperature, all of it stopped. And it took about two or three minutes and then and then the red line goes up and the bike's warmed up. And then once it got there, there's no smoke, there's no issues. And then if I just let the bike idle and not do nothing, and then it wouldn't you wouldn't even notice any smoke really. It just mainly notice smoke when you start playing with the throttle. And you can get to almost any bike at first startup before it's warm to play with the throttle. And then you're gonna see some kind of smoke or steam or mist or whatever you wanna call it, or burn it off fuels or whatever. But um, it's really not nothing to look out for. It's really not that big of a deal. Just keep an eye on the oil. Yeah, it should be good. Well, that wraps it up. I just wanted to show you guys what a bike does when it's cold and what kind of smoke if it smokes or what exactly what happened. And to tell you the truth, I kind of knew it might have smoked a little bit, but you know what I mean, I just showed you guys that. And thanks for checking out the channel. Thanks for checking out the vlog. Catch you guys next time. I'm out.